My project is in collaboration with a biotech company called Atelorix that entails storing cells in a hydrogel called alginate and printing them on demand afterwards. The ultimate aim of the project would be to develop a bioink, so people would have the cells stored in the alginate bioink, put it in the bioprinter and print whatever they would like. In the future, we could potentially print organs and models for drug discovery. This ERDF funded project has allowed us to work very closely with the university, with Anastasia, who's a stellar PhD student, um, and also with the academics. We can share knowledge, share resources, share everything to actually uh, create new products in our product development pipeline, which can eventually go onto the market. During the course of my PhD, I am partially in collaboration with Newcastle University, but mainly based at Atelorix. Our relationship works in terms of support and guidance and development of my skills in terms of leadership, scientific skills. The project is funded by ERDF IIIP and without this uh, funding I would not have come to Newcastle and I would not have experienced this uh, incredible relationship that you build. I am surrounded by people that can offer me advice and guidance and want me to succeed and develop and it's, it's been an amazing experience and I highly recommend everyone to try. <laughs> Without the ERDF funding, I don't think this uh, project would uh, happen. We were involved in so many different activities. We wouldn't really have the, the bandwidth to cover it. As well as the uh, ERDF, um, we also received uh, funds from the Northern Accelerator. What this allowed us to do was to uh, gain access to a experienced executive who became our founding CEO, who helped to transition that navigation from academia to industry. I believe that funding like this is very important for the Northeast and it has helped me develop so much that I'm in love with Newcastle, it's a beautiful city and I would like to stay here and potentially in the future even help create more jobs for science graduates and encourage people to move to the Northeast because it's, it's a hidden gem. <laughs>